Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. I just wanted to cover real quick a new variable that I just learned about. Maybe it's not new to you, but it is to me. Um, it goes in my ZSHRC or your Bash RC, and it's called CD Path. I don't know if you've heard about it, but man, I love it. So let's just go ahead and do an example here. Let's open up a terminal. Let's clear the screen, zoom in a bit here. Um, say you are in any directory, literally, uh, but let's go ahead and make a directory Actually, I've already got one made. Let's cd into dot local project and then test. So if I do a pwd, you can see I'm in home jake dot local project test. So I'm down a ways. If I do an ls, there's no other directories in here for me to cd into. So if I do a cd space and I hit tab, I get nothing for auto completion. Now, if I wanted to cd into a different directory, I could obviously type the path the path to that directory in here. But I don't want to have to type the path to the directory every time, especially when it's directories that I cd into quite often. So that being said, let's open another terminal here in a different workspace. We'll zoom in, clear the screen, and we're going to type in zconf. Maybe <laughs> zconf, which is my alias to open up my zshrc in vim. And then I believe it's line 46. So if we do 46j and jump down here, um, it's going to jump down 46 lines. And right here we have cd path equals, and then in parentheses I have root, and then I have space, and then I have home slash dot config. So that's these two directories, my root directory and my home slash dot config are the two directories I probably cd into the most when I'm using my system. So basically you need to have cd path equals and then in parentheses the directories you want to add to the cd path. Space separated with no comma. Let's go ahead and jump down here, go back and we're going to uncomment that. We're going to write and quit. We're going to close out of that terminal. Let's go ahead and close out of this terminal as well. We're going to reopen another one and zoom in. Clear the screen. Now let's cd back into that local projects test so do a pwd and we're all the way back down and remember i don't have anything in this directory no other directories i can cd into so if i wanted to do cd into etc i'd have to type in slash edc slash cd slash etc and then say sv so if i wanted to go to a different directory this is what i'd have to do normally but now that i have that variable cd path in my zshrc all i have to do is hit cd and i hit space and i hit tab and now look at all these auto completions i have I can go to that etc directory, I can go to my lib directory, I can go to ncmpcpp, I can go to my root directory, I can go to pycom, I can, which is in my .config, I can go to my zsh directory, which is in my .config, I can go to the mnt directory, which is in my root directory. All these directories are now in my autocomplete, no matter what directory I'm in, because of my cd path variable. So if I do cd space e slash, or ec e tab, then I get to do etc. If I do cd space say h and I hit tab I can do herps look or I can do home. Um, if I do cd space m and I do slash I can or tab I can do media mnt or mpv. Any one of these I can cd into. So let's go back here and say I want to go into cube browser. I just do cute cd and now if I do a pwd you can see I'm in home jake.config cute browser so now if I do a cd space and I hit tab again and say I do want to go to that etc directory I hit e and then I hit the tab for autocomplete and if I do a pwd I am now in my root slash etc directory again we'll do cd space tab do you want to show all of them sure why not um, let's go into fonts so I type f and I go, okay, well, I got flame shot and I got fonts, so let's tab into fonts, hit enter, and do PWD, and I've got, I mean, etc slash fonts. Super simple. This, let's go back into our ZSHRC 46J. I don't know how to get all the way down there. Let's do GG, go back to the top, 46J. And again, so you want to type, you want to have set opt auto CD, and then you want to type CD path equals and then you want in parentheses you want what directories you want to have in your cd path all of them space separated with no comma and then you close out you resource your zshrc or your uh, bash rc and then you have those directories no matter where you are you can cd into those with auto completion it's awesome so i hope this uh, helps you out i hope you get some use out of this if you didn't know about it if you did know about it i hope you're using it because it's pretty darn cool that being said i hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend a great week I'm praying for every one of you. God bless.